Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few cards from my Aquariuses, okay? Please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, the information is also down below in the description box. So as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aquariuses is... Says someone is trying to drain your energy and release their problems on you. So you have energy vampires trying to, um, you know, talk to you, call you, text you, um, have sex with you, or get something out of you, whatever it is. They're trying to drain you, okay? Um, you also got a lot of, ooh, uh, okay, so this one to flip out. Somebody is sad about how things ended with you, okay? But what I was going to show you was you got a lot of people watching that you don't even know, okay? Because I also know if this is not happening directly to you, it could be happening to your person or somebody around you. So put it wherever it fits, okay? I could be saying he, when really it could be a she. So flip it and reverse it how need be. So, okay, we got a little stack here. So it says hidden emotions are about to be expressed to you. So somebody's hiding their feelings, emotions, and stuff like that, but they want to express it to you. Somebody can also be having issues with being vulnerable. Also, somebody got weird family members. It says his family members is obsessed with the people that he dates. So his family members could be stalking you, watching you, and talking about you. He can even be arguing about this energy has been coming out a lot in the readings. Family members causing issues in relationships. All right, somebody could definitely be a tarot reader or a psychic since the high priestess card is coming out. But it says the information you know may scare or piss people off. So somebody knows some shit or then say some shit and now they scared and mad and stuff like that, right? Um, somebody could have had a hidden pregnancy, okay? And you also got the card that says disloyalty. It says someone is withholding important information from you and is still claiming to be your friend or family. So somebody did some fucked up shit behind their back, all right? And here we go again. Uh, somebody trying to guilt trip you too or some shit. But it says you got a lot of people watching that you don't even know. I saw somebody could be smoking a lot of weed or drinking a lot of alcohol thinking about you, okay? All right. So somebody's going through a lot of burdens, a lot of obstacles and challenges at this time. Okay, so these two cards came out together. So somebody could definitely be working in alliance with another person. Also, somebody could be having issues at work. Somebody could be attacking you at work, and it could be multiple people. But if this is not at work for you, um, these are just multiple people working together. They could be talking about somebody or trying to somebody's trying to isolate somebody trying to make someone not want to deal with someone or associate with a certain person here okay and somebody could be feeling left out in the cold and neglected okay what else we got yeah and it's causing some type of tower moment some type of shake up in somebody's life everything could be falling apart and things could be getting revealed at this time that's what happens during a tower moment okay got a few cards yeah, okay, the tower mama wanted to come out again. We got the king of swords. This could be your energy, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. But somebody could definitely be strategizing with what? Yeah, okay, so somebody strategizing on how to get through a group of people or, I don't know, it's some type of fights and arguments, competition and jealousy. That's what the five of ones is about. And it could be multiple people involved, but somebody could have to fight or get through I don't know, this is spiritual warfare because a lot of this shit has been coming out for different readings. You know what I'm saying? Um, we got the fool here. Somebody wants to go out and take some type of risk, okay? Some of y'all could be dealing with another Aquarius, but somebody wants to expand or get to someone in some type of way. We got the ten of ones with the seven of ones. It's a burden on someone's back to have to fight. And they ha could have to fight or stand up against multiple people trying to attack them. See what I'm saying? And somebody's trying to strategize. They could be cold and distant from certain people. Somebody could be hella fucking annoyed with the people around them as well. And somebody wants to have makeup sex or some type of new passion in the beginning with you. 
All right, somebody also working on their money at this time. All right, put this over here. So what I'm doing? Okay, here we go. All right, somebody is blossoming. You're healthy, energetic, and very attractive. Something new has bloomed inside of you. So somebody's going through a new cycle here, okay? Something new. Somebody could be wanting to expand, you know? Or coming up with some type of new creative ideas at this time. All right, somebody has a lot of responsibilities. It says someone still has so much to accomplish before they can give you what you desire, okay? Also, somebody could be having money issues at this time. Um, family, I want you to have my baby. So, they could want to have kids with you. We did just see a hidden pregnancy. Well, somebody could already be pregnant. Put away if it's... We got detached. Somebody could definitely be detached from certain people because it's a hell of a lot of negativity, a hell of a lot of fights and arguments and stuff. Like, look at all, look at all the defensive energy here. Like, it's, it's, it's some shit going on. All right? And somebody has to be the king of swords to protect themselves or protect someone. All right, we got courage. You're going to have to have courage right now because you're being spiritually attacked on your person and you put away if it's for you. And then root chakra, somebody trying to get their money up, having what you physically need. Also, somebody might need to ground themselves at this time so they could just be floating. But you got to figure out what you're going to do and then take action on it. But it could be hard because people are in the way or people are trying to cause some type of roadblocks or tell tell you what to do tell you what you can't do or tell you what you should do you could definitely be unique you are so different okay and since you're unique and different people could be trying to judge you or attack you in some type of way all right all right your person is emotional over you and you could also be emotional over them um somebody has a lot of wealth love and prosperity it says, I feel played and used. A Capricorn could be involved in this situation. It says, let's sneak off together, which means somebody could be in a relationship who wants to be with you. You have a lot of wisdom and knowledge. You did have the high priestess coming out, but this usually comes out for a tarot reader or a psychic. I'm, I also seen I'll do anything to see you smile. A Taurus could be involved. Know your worth and know your power. Somebody can also be taking their power back at this time. I don't care what people have to say. See, somebody's trying to protect a person or, or protect something, period. Um, but a lot of people have something to say about their business or your business. Get what I'm saying? And somebody has to protect themselves and protect like what, what they want to do or protect what's theirs, period. Get what I'm saying? I'm so miserable and tired of pretending I'm not sad. Don't give up on us. So they don't want you to give up on a relationship because they do want to marry you or see you as wifey material or hubby material. Um, somebody could be desired by many men. It says a fight broke out, right? A fight broke out because somebody been speaking the truth and they don't like it. So somebody feels exposed for the truth coming out. It says, can I spend the night? And it says, my friends like you a little bit too much. So somebody's friends likes they person. Um, I need to talk to you, but I'm scared to reach out to you. Somebody saving money. They are going to make it hard for us to be together. I can't handle your words right now. So they want to talk to you, but just they trying to get themselves together first or figure out exactly what they're going to say or do first. And someone has been false claiming you or false say, saying they fuck somebody or been with them or something like that. And somebody's having powerful visions at this time. All right. They psychic or terrorist or something. The boy is mine. So there's another person who wants to fight you over this person. And somebody been keeping all their secrets. So there's definitely multiple people involved. Right. I'm also seeing it wasn't easy for me to walk away. All right. And I'm also seeing they will humiliate me if I tell the truth. So somebody's afraid to tell the truth. Okay. Oh, shit. Hold on, y'all. Stuff falling. Please don't forget to hit that like button, y'all. It really helps out my channel. Thank y'all so much for your support. All right. All right. Somebody could live in an unsafe area or just something is unsafe, period. Somebody left someone while they was pregnant. It says romance is on the way and you are loved by many. 
we can take things slow if you like if you like i said white my bad i'm sorry it says house fights over you it says we got trying to get back in your good grace we got coming back to be with you female friend we got self-improvement we got suicidal thoughts of you leaving me telling lies on you so somebody was doing spell work on someone and he knows about it in some type of way spell work is not always um bringing out the candle work and stuff like that spell work is like what you say if you say i wish this person's business was failed or i wish these two people would break up or i wish this person to die that's black magic what you neg negativity is black magic so be careful what you speak okay but he evidently knows about it or is hearing about it around him okay but he know you didn't know you were in competition they could be talking about your sex to others and it was already over when i met my new love interest um so somebody fell in love and then that was it uh comfortable being love vibrational with the karmic so they don't want to make they used to the toxic shit and they scared of something like good because they so used to the toxic shit okay and it says i want to wait i want to take you on a date and i'm also saying you can't run from destiny and y'all have a deep mental connection with each other okay all right let's see who all could be involved a Sagittarius could be involved. I'm seeing Cancer on the other end. Who all could be involved, Spirit? A Capricorn could be involved. I think Capricorn came out in here. A Gemini or a Virgo could be involved. Um, Another Aquarius could be involved. A Leo could be involved. And a Sagittarius could be involved. Virgo, Gemini, Sagittarius again. Sagittarius want to come out again. Libra want to come out. Scorpio is peeking out, but it didn't come out. Gemini, Aries. All right, and then we got the moon card, so somebody wants to remain hidden. And we got Earth, Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus, all right? And then Taurus is at the bottom of the deck. All right, and let's get some love messages real quick. Whew. All right. As soon as I open up the deck, it says you are so secretive and it's hard to read you. So somebody likes to keep them their business to themselves. They could be a private person, but they're finding it hard to read you or figure you out. But they're definitely trying to figure you out, okay? So first off, it says, I'm sorry that I broke your heart and left you in pieces. Okay. I hope I'm not running out of time to fix this. So they're worried. Okay. They don't want to let you go. They want you to keep hope. It says, they are mad because you make them feel exposed by the things you say and you see it right through them. So somebody exposed some shit by saying some shit in some type of way. And now people are getting mad at them for saying the shit or breaking the shit or breaking some type of illusions that was going on you get what i'm saying and it says i'm still stuck on you waiting and hoping things will work out for this you also got the card that says i like me better when i'm with you i'm focusing doing things to hide my vibration yeah so they they with the karmic right they could be low vibrational and then you're high vibrational and it says i'm embarrassed that you have so much more than me and i have little to give you so they could definitely be working on their finances at this time, trying to get their money up. And it says, I want to go out and have fun with you. I want to be seen with you publicly. If I fucked up, I'm sorry. Here's 50 racks for the stress. You would think I was crazy if you knew how much I watched you. I know that you can have anyone you want, and that scares me. So please like this video if it resonates at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.